All right, Sam, so tell us what happened here this afternoon. Okay, so me and Dad, we were out looking at some floods, and as we were coming out of the uni, I saw this big pink flamingo out, out in the middle of the field out here in distress, and I knew immediately when I saw it, I knew what to do. So what I did was I walked through this water behind me all the way out to the middle of the field, grabbed it, and I brought it over to the water to its natural habitat. And then I brought it over to the road over here. And I was like, Dad, there's a bird in distress here. And then we call the bird sanctuary. And then what happened was they took the bird in and we don't know if the bird has deflated or lived on, so yeah. So it must have been pretty scary when you first saw the bird. What was your immediate reaction? What did you think you had to do? What I thought I had to do was, oh my God, I have to save this bird immediately, otherwise it will die. Yeah, so it was out there and it was, it was in the middle of the field, but you could tell it had been flapping around in the water as well. Like, did it, did it look like it was running out of air? Did, uh, it, did it look like it's, was its demeanor a bit deflated? Or yeah. how, how was it? How was it looking when you first got to it? Um, wasn't looking too good, to be honest, but um, yeah, but yeah. that's all. So at any time, while you were retrieving this bird and saving it from certain death, was there any time that you were concerned for your own safety? Uh, uh, not really, but one time I did step on a needle and that really didn't um, make me too happy. Um, you know, it could have wrapped around and grabbed me on the leg. Um, otherwise, but that, you know, good day, saved the bird, didn't deflate, I hope, you know did a good job. That's great mate, so you, you should be pretty pleased with yourself, I mean that, that's, a, that's a rare bird to be found on the central coast, let alone a rimba, so I mean you've got to be pretty happy that you've, you've done a good deed here today and, and, and you know, uh, saved that bird and, and made sure that it's, it's gone to uh, somewhere safe. Yeah, well, you know, it was probably the only one of its kind in this particular spot, you know, so I just had to save it, you know. Yeah. That one certainly stood out, didn't it? I mean, it was it was pretty obvious that there, that was there was a problem. I mean, it was yeah. it was it was in trouble. Yeah, it was in trouble. You know, you can obviously see where the water was if you look around here, where all those leaves are. It was all the way up to there when I got it. You know, that bird could have died. That's unreal, mate. And I think you should be congratulated because you've done a, a really good deed here today. And I'm sure the people of Arimba are going to be very very happy with you and yeah. and pleased that you've. Uh, that you've saved such an exotic bird, you know, and um, that's, you know, you should be commended, mate. So, um, yeah, uh, well done. Good on you, Sam. Thanks.